For the past 23 years, the Middleburg Humane Foundation has accomplished thousands of rescues. As a private nonprofit shelter, we provide rescue, medical and dental care, rehabilitation and training, and finally, qualified adoptions to the animals that come through our doors. Most of these are referred to MHF because they cannot be housed or rehabilitated in other facilities. MHF goes even further in its efforts to make a difference by providing extensive community outreach within a 50-mile radius, including parts of West Virginia, Maryland, and Washington, D.C. We are one of the few organizations performing trap, neuter, vaccinations, and housing for feral and community cats. Since we saw you last June, we have had so many unique challenges, we thought we would describe just one. Last July, MHF assisted with the surrender of 11 dogs, including nine Great Pyrenees, five pigs, four goats, three bearded dragons, two cats, and 55 fowl. MHF volunteers and staff gathered that day to rescue the animals in 100 degree heat. The animals were in such dire condition, they occupied every veterinary emergency room in our area. There weren't enough emergency hospitals to accommodate the high number of animals. Sadly, none of the birds survived due to extreme dehydration. We tell you this story to give you a glimpse into one of the many challenges we face on a regular basis. After months of extensive and intensive rehabilitation, we are proud to say that of the animals we rescued that day, most have been adopted and some are still waiting for their forever homes. From June 2016 to June 2017, we have assisted over 550 animals, which includes our medical assistance program for low-income families. Over the last two years, we have doubled our intake of animals. Thank you for providing the resources enabling us to increase our rescues. While running our current shelter, we have been busy building our new facility, which will allow us to treat many more animals. Our large animal barn and equipment shed have been constructed, and we are about to start excavation on the main adoption building and humane education center. Well, we're excited because we have raised almost 65% of the money needed to do everything. The board has been very supportive, 100% participation with the board with good fundraising and we've got real momentum on our side now. The main building will consist of a state-of-the-art veterinary and dental care clinic. Among the many partnerships we hope to develop, one partnership in particular will be with the Virginia Maryland School of Veterinary Medicine, Virginia Tech. Rotating students will complete an elective block in shelter medicine. New indoor-outdoor housing for our dogs and cats will simulate a home environment and provide them with a healthy outcome, progressing rehabilitation. We will have a separate senior area, puppy play area, long-term care, and pocket pet care. Separate isolation areas and a quarantine room will reduce stress and limit the spread of infection. A training pavilion will allow us to hold classes throughout the year. The grooming salon and new retail shop will provide a source of income. The upgraded facility will allow MHF to increase programming, establish relationships with educational institutions, continue working with local veterinarians, become compliant with new state regulations for animal shelters, and provide robust outreach for residents. To finish our new Adoption and Humane Education Center, we need your help. Thank you. Turning heads to see the colors It goes on and on